On behalf of the Department of Energy and all the Hanford site employees, I'd like to thank you all for being here and joining us today for this wonderful 20-year uh, celebration. As you know better than I, 16 million tons of waste from the River Corridor was put here, 18 million tons total. And what would we have done with that waste if we wouldn't have put it in URDF? We would have had to ship it off to an off-site facility someplace. It would have cost the U.S. taxpayers millions, if not billions, of dollars, and we would still be cleaning up the river corridor. This team has been operating IRTA for 20 years and doing it safely and in compliance is just tremendous. Well, if we didn't have uh, IRTA, we would uh, definitely not have done the cleanup we've done, so a lot of areas along the river would not be cleaned up. We'd probably be capping waste sites in place and uh, trying to clean out buildings as best we could, but uh, we definitely would have more treatment systems down by the river for the groundwater, because what we've been able to do with the disposal capacity at IRTA is remove the soils that are contaminated near the river that are the source of the groundwater contamination and move those up here to a compliant disposal facility on the Central Plateau. We cleaned up 228,000 pounds of chromium just in 2014. And for an example, and all of that we treated. We processed it through a chemical process here at IRTA to convert the chromium to a more stable form that won't go in through the groundwater, that'll just stay with the ground, with the dirt and the waste that's in here. Uh, lead, we treat all the lead so that it doesn't, it's not mobile. So we encapsulate in grout, uh, concrete, um, any material like technesium 99 and other other things that could be mobile and go into the groundwater we encapsulate that so it doesn't have a chance to do that and then finally of course we protect it so the water doesn't push it through anyway uh, so it is a very well engineered and designed i think it's a beautiful hole um, without this without this barrel ground here and the operation of it we couldn't be doing the cleanup at hanford